All right, let's see if I can figure this out. I'm going to play the Treasure Hunt Sahara quote unquote extreme challenge against Egypt, just like everyone else. I don't know how many times I've played this thing. I mean, 50, 60, I've lost count. I don't care. I hate it. It's boring. I wish EA would add at least a different team, you know, mix it up a little bit, man. I mean, how hard is it for you guys to figure out over there at EA that your game is boring and not engaging and that you might actually, you know, sell more stuff if you provide people with a more engaging, fun experience. Game should be fun. The game shouldn't be chore, a chore. It should be something you look forward to, not something you dread. And it's uh, one of my big gripes with the with the game this year is that um, man, it just they just crank out these new cards and new you know programs, but they don't they don't put a whole lot of effort, in my opinion, into making the game fun. Now, having said that, yeah, I play it. Um, I'm you know I'll admit I'm addicted to it. <laughs> I got to get my daily fix just like everyone else. Hey, I'm human. Don't judge me. And, um, you know, if not for the community, though, and a lot of the the people I've met on Twitter and interact with from all over the world play the game, um, I probably would have quit, to be honest with you, uh, just because I don't think the game is that good. Um, Let's say this. There's a lot of room for improvement. I think I think we can all agree on that. It, it, there are aspects of the game that I really, really like. They're a lot of fun. But I would say that the, the cons uh, outweigh the pros at this point. And um, if nothing else, man, give me a different match to play. I don't want to play Egypt every single time. You know, let me play Italy. Let me play, I mean, it, okay, let me play another African nation. Let's put it that way. Let me play Ivory Coast. Let me play Cameroon. Let me play some of the other nations uh, that um, these featured cards are from, not just Egypt every single time. You know? Imagine that. Okay, now I'm starting to panic. Uh, Sometimes I get a little bit lazy in this match, even though it's actually really easy. The strategy is basically just um, go down here into the corner and whip in a finesse shot and... Just repeat that process over and over. I think my highest score is six. Sometimes I get motivated. I try to score seven. Sometimes I just get lazy and don't care, and I do stuff like I'm doing right now and screw around and see how many relays I can do. <laughs> or if I can score with my goalkeeper, who's Joe Hart, by the way. He's he's not good. He's not very good. He's not terrible. Wasn't good enough for Pep Guardiola uh, since he can't play with his feet. As far as goalkeepers in the game go, he's he's okay. He's decent. He was a cheap option for a number one goalkeeper, which happened to be the uh, you know the most skill boosts I had since I was going primarily for legendary. Retrospect, I probably would have done something different. And a lot of really good cards with epic skill boosts. Donnarumma, team of the week, is the goalkeeper I used initially for a long time. It was great, uh, but. Uh, number one keeper got me a plus one overall and so that's what I did and Joe Hart was the cheapest way to do that so anyway another random video with some commentary there you go Um, hopefully we get some better content coming soon from this event thanks